Hey guys, alright, so I'm here with a little Lush haul. As you, okay, as you can see, um, so I've tried doing this video so many times. I didn't have problems uploading it, but I've been interrupted every single time. Or, like, I take too long and the computer just stops. So, I'm going to do this quickly. I really don't have that much stuff, but, um, so hopefully we get to this. Right, the first thing I'm going to show you is Cupcake. It's a mask. It's one of their really good masks. Okay. And it says Chocolate Heaven for Oily and Teenage Skin. And this is made by Rosie. Thanks, Rosie. Yeah. You made March 10th. Used by April 10th. It says used by 12, April 10. Oh, well. Okay, so the cupcake says to smell like chocolate and like mint. And it does. And it looks like icing, like chocolate icing. Like, oh, you have no idea how badly I, just, I wanted to eat it. It smells really good, too. So I gotta go put that back in the fridge soon. So this is vegan, too. It's a little right there. So that's the first thing. The next thing I got is the Laid Back Class. The other big thing I got was um, Dark Angels. I got quite a lot. This is just for oily skin and it's like coal and stuff and uh, you can obviously see what it looks like and yeah. So. This is my, this is like my everyday like facial stuff. Clean my face with. This is an interesting smell. I quite like it though. The next thing I got is a soap. Um, I couldn't resist. I ended up getting porridge. Put a plastic bag and I put the name tag on it. That's what it looks like. It has oats. It smells like sweets and butter and cream and baking like a bakery it smells so good and it looks so creamy like crazy it smells like oatmeal and sugar and just porridge is like you can't skip porridge whatsoever she gave me a pretty good slice too Give me a good chunk. Um, next thing I got is a sample of a hand cream, and that would be Handy Guru Goo hand cream. If you can, probably not. I don't have autofocus, but that's what that looks like. It's really, really, really minty, like kind of like a cologne smell. It smells like a men's cologne, and I swear to God, it smells like my mom's perfume. I'm not even joking. It's like a dupe of my mom's perfume. It's crazy. This works really good. So she gave me a huge sample, personally. She very generous sample. All right, so I got two bath things, but I used it to I used it last night. My first bath thing was I got a bath bomb. That was in here. I just couldn't even express how it smelled. It smelled, it smelled so good. It was sex bomb. And Sex Bomb is like pink all over the body and kind of like purple at the top. And it has like a rose in the center. And it's really heavy. And yeah, that was like a really heavy bomb. Some of them are like really, really light. This one's really kind of heavy. I think they made these minis now. But at my last place, they still have some in like the regular size. Okay, so this smells creamy soya milk swirls of pink and purple. Fra fragrance of jasmine, clary sage, and lang lang. And let your imagination run wild. I don't know, but it smells absolutely amazing. It smells like a really clean shampoo. I don't even know. I soaked my hair in it. I just soaked in there for hours. It was really nice. I just can't let that smell go. Alright. The next thing I got was Sunny Side. I think that's what it's called. I hate when people get something and then they don't know what it's called. But then again, I don't really go in there with the list. I think Sunny Side was right. I'm right, Sunny Side Bubble Bar. Alright, so this is really, really, really glittery. That's okay. Uh, oh, if 
freaking gone. If I were to drop this, this is really orangey. This smells really good. This probably smells like the best to me. This background, this bubble bar. It's really citrusy. But not overpowering. Kind of like a sweet citrus. Oh my goodness. Look at all the glitter. Oh, it doesn't come off. Great. <laughs> oh my god, it's really funny. It's like stuck on me. It smells good too. Alright, I'll just rub that on my skin here. Rub that on my legs. <laughs> Get all this glitter off. It's not coming off at all. Alright, now I'm like really, really glittery. You can't see it, but I'm really glittery. <laughs> ah! Anyways, so let's get on with it. Okay, this bubble bar, um, this bubble bar is not supposed to make your bathtub, oh sorry, I made a really weird face. <laughs> this bubble bar is not supposed to make your bathtub more of um, bubbles, but more of like liquid gold. That's the kind of thing that it says, but most people say it doesn't even like barely make a goldy color. Um, so it says it smells like orange, lemon, and tangerine and essential oil. So obviously you can tell it's citrus. But it's not like that strong, like, what's a really citrus cleaner that's like so overpowering? It's just like a, ugh, I think it's 401 or something like that. I don't know, but it smells so good. I can't even describe the smell, but it was like my favorite one. Yeah, I'll probably definitely repurchase this one. It smells so good. My other, the other, crap, the other bath bomb I, bubble bar I really liked was, um, Pop of the Bath. And that was like a sweet citrusy smell. Like, it's kind of hard to ex explain Pop in the Bath. But I definitely loved Pop in the Bath. I didn't like creamy candy at all. Okay, so delightfully, delightfully uplifting bergamot and citrus fragrance. It's kind of similar to the olive branch shower gel, and I did like the olive branch. That's a really different kind of smell. Bergamot helps put your mind at ease while lemon, orange flower, mandarin oils inspire happiness. So this is orange, lemon, and like lime, or I think lime. And this one's like lemon, orange flower, mandarin. I can't even remember, in bergamot or whatever. I ha I think per Pop in the Bath and this one, Sunnyside Bubble Bar, are like my favorite bubble bars because they smell so good. They're like sweet, but they're not overpowering citrus because I smell some citrus and it's like, this smells like lemon. Citrus to me, every time someone says citrus, I think of lemon or something. Not oranges. I really don't. Which you're probably supposed to, but I don't. I also liked my, ba my bar, but it just literally just smelled like honey wash kids. Nothing special about it. Just... I expected it to smell better. And then I went and looked at Monge too, and that smelled really bad. I think my favorite massage bar probably smells like Soft Cure, and that just smells like pure chocolate. So, that's just a little of my opinions. But, um, yeah, so that's all I got from Lush, and I got, I like, I hope you guys enjoy this, so, bye guys.